All right, here we go. If you are daring enough, you're going to try to get on the BOSU just like Holly did and do squats, deep squats. You're repping these out, good form, until you hear the siren, and then you're just going to hold it. A little shaking going on, arms out for more core. If you can't do it on the BOSU, do it on the ground. It still works. Don't worry about it. All right, here we go. We got a wide stance with your feet angled out a little bit. It's kind of like a sumo squat. Got your shoulders back, head up, and notice she's not coming all the way up. It's called a partial, meaning she's coming up, but she's not coming up and locking her legs out. Show them what I'm talking about. See, we're not doing that. We're staying in it, middle range of motion, not all the way down too deep, not all the way up and locking out. And you're gonna just feel the burn in the booty where you wanna feel it. All right, on the core trainer, she's leaning into it a little bit. She's gonna bring it to her chest and her hips are gonna push back into a good squat. She's on the balls of her feet, leaning into it. Her heels are off the ground. Good body position, core tight. It's called lumber jacks. Just rep these out with good form. All right, on the wall, you got the handles up about eyeball high. She's got a slider on the back leg, and notice her leg is straight. She's just got the ball of her foot on the slider. She's pushing through that front heel, and notice her knee is come trapped. All right, here we go. A little mountain climber with your hands elevated. Makes it a little bit easier on the arms, but you're gonna get plenty of core work. You're even gonna feel this in your quads. Again, if you need to modify, show them the modification. Just do one, but if you can, you're gonna really get it, as long as you can.